Hi everyone, um, my name's Greg. I'm Jazz. Um, we're the two new presidents for the MESS committee for this next year. Um, we're just kind of doing a little bit of like an introductory video to um, tell you a little bit about what the Doctors' Mess is and what we'll be doing for like the next year. Um, so like what, what happens is basically £10 is taken out of your kind of like pre-tax wage that you get each month and that'll be added to a kind of um, mess pot of money that we have that will help kind of contribute to maintaining the doctor's mess areas which is where you'll go for like your breaks or you'll well yeah you go for your breaks go on your on call it's just kind of like a chill out area i suppose um and then we also use that pot of money to organize events and stuff across the year so the mess is actually opposite the um theaters upstairs um a lot of us have lunch there there's a coffee machine there's frozen meals for you if you forget your lunch or your nights or something. Um, and there's always fresh milk, so you can have a cup of tea. Um, it cool. also funds, the money funds events. Um, so we try and organise one every month. These have been like, um, we've gone to a darts bar recently. We mm. There's a mess ball coming up. Um, and... Yeah, yeah there's loads of different things events, like meals and stuff across the year. Um, there's often like open bars and things like that as well. We so we'll just literally put some money behind the bar. You can all let yourself loose, get a little bit of naughty. Um, and we'll also get like um, dominoes and stuff like that in fairly frequently and stuff. It'll just be delivered to the mess and you can just help yourself. And if you're having like, if you're having rubbish on call and you want some food delivered, then um, you can just message one of us and we can. Um, like pay for the Uber Eats. Oh my god, I didn't know that. That's a thing. <laughs> yeah, not all the time, but I mean, sometimes. Um. So yeah. So with all of the events and stuff that we do across the year, so if you, if you do pay the ten pound, a lot of the events will just be completely free for you. Like like I said, you'll be able to help yourself to the free bars and things like that that we do. Um. Or you'll always have to pay like a lot less than the non-paying members anyway. If you do decide to opt out but you still want to go to the events, you will end up having to pay a little bit more, and those benefits won't. Come, come free to you um just with regards to kind of like us as the mess committee as well um we're looking for people to come and join us please um you know we had like four or five like f1s last year um that helped out and it's basically just helping us like organize events and things like that there isn't really much to it we're just part of a whatsapp group we just chat every now and again and um publicize events and things that we've done but um it'll look good on your cv um, so yeah, just message one of us, me or Jazz, if um, you wanna you wanna join the committee. Yeah. Yeah, and I think um, some of you have said that you were trying to organise something, um, but because obviously you're just newly starting. So um, if one of you wants to let me know, and we can potentially put some money towards um, a meal or something. And then I was looking at maybe booking Canal House, um, maybe in the first week or something. Um, so I'll let you know about that. So if you just join the F1, no, if you join the mess group, which I'm need to um, start on WhatsApp, and then details will be on there, and it'll be like a kind of sign up sheet to events and things. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, so come and join us. Don't opt out because you'll miss out on the free little perks. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah, and have a good start to your F1 as well, and messages if you need any help with anything. Yeah. yeah. Alright, thank you.